My name is Terry Luna and I wanted to call in because I feel threatened. I am involved in a very serious situation that I have an ex-boyfriend that I met on Facebook and he is overseas and he has been stalking my Gmail and my social media profiles for over four years now and I got a threatening message from him, his name is Mika Ajala from Manta, Finland, Europe. And so I broke up with him for four years ago and he has been electronically harassing me online through my Gmail account and my social media profiles. So I got screenshots, I got pictures saved, I got uh, numerous uh, abusive emails involving uh, inappropriate sexual content. He's an online sex offender, and I had come across some females that know him for uh, sexually assaulting women, and since I broke okay, up so with Mika... Hold, hold on. Uh, okay. okay. I'm going to get... I'll get some history in a minute. Okay. What I'm going to ask some standard questions. Okay. If you're wanting to make a report about the harassment. Yes, I do. Okay. So let's first... The last... I'm sorry? Miss it. When did you see receive the last message? Uh, your might media? be about 20 to 30 minutes ago. And what was the threat that was said? His name is Mika Ajala, and I'm making all these YouTube videos to show him that I'm saving all his emails. And the last message okay, no. he on. sent me... My question, what was the what I was know, the I'm threat? trying to tell you. The last message he sent me was a direct message that saying, Mika knows your YouTube videos and he knows where your geographic location is at and he knows where you live. That's what the threatening message is because he's been stalking me online for over four years now. So I'm okay, making do you, have a, do you own any weapons? I do not own any weapons. And I do suffer from mental illness. I'm a paranoid schizophrenia. And all this behavior over the years is driving me freaking insane. I'm serious. I'm mentally distraught from this guy. Okay. And you're not injured at this time needing paramedics, correct? No. Okay. And are you current on your meds? Yes. Yes, I am. Does your ex-boyfriend use drugs or alcohol? He's a hardcore alcoholic. He drinks about 30 to 50 beers a drinking session. He is a hardcore alcoholic, and he's not right in the head. He's a sociopath, uh, borderline. Okay, well, hold on. So I'm going to get his na first name first. What is his first name? His name is Mika. He lives in Finland. M-I-K-A? M-I-I. K K A. And his last name? Ojala. O J A L A. And what race is he? Uh, European white. Okay. And what is his date of birth? Um, May 27, 1974. And what would you guess his height and weight to be? Um, I really do not know. And the bad part about it is I never met this guy so in person and I do okay. not know how much he weighs and I do not know how his height is but I know he's overweight he's fat okay and what color is his hair black okay do you know of any scars marks or tattoos he has a lot of tattoos of satanic symbols do you know what body parts he has them on on his arms both arms? Yes. Okay, and does he have facial hair? Uh, no. Okay. And does he have a contact number? Uh, no, but you could look up his Facebook profile names. Okay, what is it? Okay, one of, he has different, um, profile names. Uh, um was talking with you guys and the, my uh, call dropped and I wanted oh, to okay. I wanted to um, continue my complaint about an ex-boyfriend that won't leave me alone 
for over four years now. He's online stalking me on my uh, Gmail and my social media profile accounts. So Okay. And it does look like they did set up your call for service. Um, so it looks like they received, let me just double check here. They do have all the information they need at this time. Okay. Um, so your call for service is up. You are good to go. And um, an officer will be out there. Uh, let me see here. It could take an hour, maybe a little less, maybe a little more, somewhere around that time frame to have them out there. So if anything changes between now and then, you're more than welcome to call us back at this phone number, and we will modify the call for you. Um, however, if he does, if you do see him outside of your apartment, you can call us at 911, okay? Okay. Sounds good. All right. Perfect. Thank well, you. you. Have a good night. Thanks. Thank you. Bye-bye.